Hey, what's up, guys? I just wanted to do a quick video on the University of Utah football. Um, I was able to just watch the uh, spring football game today. I was out of town last week because I was unable to attend. Um, things look, uh, with the new offensive co coordinator, uh, Dennis Erickson, at the offense looks a lot better. Um, they're running a lot more plays, more huddle, uh, no huddle, and it seems like the play calling's really improved. I think his, you know, knowledge is really going to help Brian Johnson and the rest of the offensive staff. Um, some of the, the 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 thing about tough, the spring games is tough is they they've really played a vanilla defense, and some a lot of players were playing. Um, but Travis Wilson looks a lot better. Looks to be improved um, a lot better than his freshman year. And they have depth at the position. Adam Schultz, uh, former walk-on, he looked he looked pretty good. He had a, I know he, I, he had some a pick, one or two picks. But and there's de also depth at running back as far as James Poole. Uh, he looks he that guy is quick. And Carl Williams um, last year was a fullback. Um, they converted him to running back this year. He's lost some weight, and he had 108 yard games in this in the spring game. And James Poole had 62 yards rushing and 49 yards receiving. Now, of course, I believe Kevin York will be the starter next year. I didn't really see him play. I don't think he played. But um, they also have uh, Lucky Radley. They have a lot of depth. So I think you know the the question is here is how are they going to divvy up carries and uh, are these going to go to two guys or they can have three guys should be interesting to see anyway um and uh rec receivers you know drez anderson had a big play early in the game he had 71 yards receiving uh kenneth scott i love kenneth scott he to me he's the pac-12 receiver maybe not speed wise but size he has a lot of size i think he can be a great uh, possession receiver he had 90, 97 yards receiving at a td and uh Delshawn McClellan, uh, freshman, I believe Richard, freshman. He had 102 yards receiving in a TD. He had a real explosive play in the game. He looked good, and he has a lot of speed. I believe, I believe he's the quickest guy on the team. So, um, you know, not a lot to really, I mean, it's hard to predict this. I, you know, my, my thoughts is I think defensively, of course, when you lose star, low loot, uh, uh the defense is really going to take a hit, but I think the offense is going to be better. So it's hard to say. I think the team, I want to see them finish better than they did last year, um, but it's hard to say right now. You really got to see them when everybody's playing at full speed to see really get a, a better feel. But anyway, um, I'd like to see your comments. Uh, what do you think? If any guys watch the spring game, what do you think? Do you feel optimistic, or do you think this is kind of one of those, you know, things where you get a lot of PR stuff where you said, hey, you know, because every spring game, everybody loves, you know, all their talent, their recruits, and how everything's looking. So um, I'm just going to kind of be, you know, cautiously optimistic and kind of reserve a lot of judgment, though, I think. But let me know what you think. Subscribe rate my videos, and please leave your comments. Thanks a lot.